Hello everybody. My name is He Jiabei from Nankai University, and our team name is NKU HLT Lab. I'm so glad to share our solution submitted to Voice Privacy 2024 Emotional Preserving Prosody Anonymization Network for Voice Privacy Protection. The presentation is divided into four parts problem statement, motivation, design and details, and the last, evaluations. Okay, let's come to the problem statement. Two main differences in this year is the first, it requires authors level anonymization instead of the speaker level in the previous years. Second, we have to retain the original emotion expression in the anonymized speech. By analyzing the officially provided baselines, we found that prosody in a speech contains a lot of emotional features. However, speaker-dependent features are also in there. So there is a confliction between emotional expression and privacy performance. If we want to perform anonymization and emotional preservation more thoroughly, we need more fine-grained feature disentanglement on the speech and the prosody. So we decide to propose a anonymization solution based on faculty deck for its outstanding disentanglement performance on speech. And here is our architecture. The main body is a faculty deck. Faculty deck disentanglement audio into tokenized the temper feature, prosody feature, content feature, and acoustic details. Acoustic details are not shown in the picture because it's not used for reconstructing the audio. Adding the original acoustic feature is actually not good for content clarity. And here we design a prosody anonymization network to filter the original speaker information in the speech and to keep the emotional features. In our framework during the anonymization, the temper here and the prosody here will be conversed at the same time, so the anonymization can be more. Fakodak extract the prosody from the low frequency 20 dimension of 80 dimension male spectrogram. Our prosody anonymization modular panel restructs the raw prosody from one speaker style to another. Let's see the architecture of panel in details and how to implement the function. Panel is based on CVAE, including prosody encoder and a prosody decoder. Prosody encoders maps the prosody into latent space, and prosody decoder outputs the reconstructed prosody according to the frame level latent prosodic features and the prompt speaker embedding. In training process, we add a GRL speaker classifier to force prosody encoder extract the speaker independent feature. And for the prosody decoder, we add a prosody discriminator just like the way in GUN. It discriminates the generated and the real prosody and calculates the feature distance between them. It can help the prosody decoder generate more realistic prosody. We use five losses in the training process. KL loss and reconstruction loss is from CVAE. Adversary loss and feature matching loss from prosody discriminator is to optimize the prosody decoder. AAM loss from GIL speaker classifier is to optimize the prosody encoder. Alpha here is to control the AAM loss in the same scale of other losses. Panel can converge in around five epochs as the data dimension of the prosody is not large. Strategy is also important for anonymization. How to choose the right pseudo speaker to anonymize the data set? Our method is named the closest to center distance. For each data set, we calculate its uh, 
center in the speaker domain and we will pick the one in the pseudo speaker pool that is closest to the dark blue center and use this red point pseudo speaker to anonymize the whole data set here is the evaluation in three aspects our solution is compared with the six other officially provided baselines in SER performance evaluated on IEMO cap, our solution is second only to the baseline two in average UAR. In ASR performance evaluated on liver speech, our solution achieved the first in average WER, and it proves that the prosody conversion doesn't influence the content clarity so much. In privacy performance evaluated on liver speech two, our solution is second only to baseline 5 in average EER. We additionally summarize the comprehensive performance rank in a table. From this table, we can see that other baselines fail to balance the privacy performance and the utility performance somehow. Our solution mitigates the confliction by using prosody anonymization network. It proves the privacy performance and at the same time reduce the influence to the emotion expression and the content clarity caused by anonymization. If three aspects are averagely important, our solution can achieve the best in the average rank. If half weighted for privacy and half for utility, our solution can also achieve the best. That's all about my representation. Thank you for your attention and listening.